As the Broncos and the Panthers finalize their game plans for Super Bowl 50, law enforcement is doing the same. And they haven't forgotten that one target of ISIS in Paris last November was a big soccer match with the president of France among the fans. Two men securing the Super Bowl talked to our Michelle Miller. In the ramp up to Sunday's Super Bowl, the FAA has banned consumer drones. Part of a 50 agency crackdown marshaled by Homeland Security Secretary Jay Johnson. Is there a credible threat against the Super Bowl? We know of no specific credible threat directed at the Super Bowl. Still, Super Bowl security is at a near lockdown level. License plates on cars crossing bridges are recorded. The cargo in every truck entering the stadium is scanned. On game day, the skies over Levi Stadium will be a no-fly zone. But all week, Customs and Border Protection Black Hawk choppers have had the San Francisco Bay Area under surveillance. John Purdy is in command. We can put eyes on any, anyone within the 30 nautical mile radius in a pretty short amount of time. But after all of that, Secretary Johnson says the very fans he's trying to protect may themselves be the best defense. If you see something, say something. Has it worked? I believe it has. The FBI is staging six secret locations in and around Levi Stadium, Scott, all to protect the 70,000 fans expected on game day. Michelle, thanks.